Good morning and welcome um, to the video of flat um, 18 Clarendon Road here in Cliftonville. Uh, this property is a stunning um, apartment, ground floor, uh, lower ground floor apartment, garden apartment, um, in a very, very attractive, um, well-maintained period building. Um, very, very handily located for all the little shops, um, small galleries um, on North Down Road, as well as access to Dane Park, the old town and the galleries in the old town, um, you know, the Friedman Gallery, the... Um, Turner Contemporary um, Gallery as well, as well as the station, the main sands, all the bars and restaurants in the old town are a very short walk, walking distance um, from this particular property. Um, this is completely bespoke, this property, totally unique. Um, dealt with this client for um, a number of years and um, she really does create something a little bit unusual and a little bit special. Um, so I'm gonna take you around um, the property, um, give you sort of a flavor for it, but you know, the video probably doesn't do it justice and you really do need to come and have a look at this property um, to appreciate everything um, that is sort of currently on offer here and the size to be fair. So we're in the living room here, which is sort of 19 by 15, eight and it really is a lovely size. Um, the radiators are either um, Victorian um, cast iron or they have come uh, 1960s ones from schools recycled. Um, there's a number of sort of um, interesting facts and features about this particular property that I will try and list as I go around, but there is a huge number of them. Um, so um, I may not be able to remember everything, um, but, um, it, it said just come and have a look at it I think is probably the best thing I can possibly say um, so this is the living room you've got your own completely your own individual um, front door you can do holiday rentals Airbnb in this particular building now here is the uh, entrance door and there is a handy storage area here which I'm just going to pull out there very very deep under the stairs, but plenty of room in there for storage. The little front garden, which is entirely um, of yours um, here. Difficult to see and not obviously the best time of year, but this actually has been awarded um, sort of a gold award in the um, Cliftonville and Margate Garden in Bloom um, competition for the last few years. So um, yeah, a beautiful little space um, to have. I mean, Clanford Road's a great, great road, as I said, really located. It's not a road you'd go down unless you had to, so there's not lots of passing traffic. So this is all tiled in here, and then you've got this huge reception hall. Obviously, a lot of storage, a lot of racking, so if anyone is, uh, you know, um, interested in the collecting books or records or vinyl as, as here, then it obviously makes a perfect um, space. The lease here is 120 years and the ground rent's £130 per annum, and the maintenance charge is £14.25. There's quite an active sort of residence association um, with regard to um, how the building's looked after. Even events to as such, because you've got the communal gardens, um, they um, have, you know, they all sort of speak to each other about um, using it. Um, one part sort of an Italian ornament, um, ornamental garden with... Um, sort of orchids and bits and pieces. The other one's a bit more of a sort of a um, vegetable um, garden, so a little bit more practical. So we'll go back through the lounge and we'll take you through to the kitchen. Um, we've got the um, seagrass carpeting all the way through um, there. So this is the bespoke handmade kitchen. Now a little bit about this. This is actually made of African teak and the units were sourced all from the um, South Bank University, and they were hand-built here by Martin Bates, the master carpenter of Rupert Blanchard Designs. So it's quite a well-known um, company, um, high quality, and said all, all, all handmade from these units from the South Bank. You've got these lovely tiles. Lovely tiled floor as well. Now the kitchen um, itself 
is um, 19 by 7 1. You've got a little breakfast bar there. And then that leads to this handy little sort of um, study area or in a hall, um, whatever you want to sort of call or use. Um, there you can see what I was talking about, the nice cast iron radiators. Very big, bespoke and individual room. And that's uh, 10 by 7 1. So this is a stunning flat. And the cupboard just behind is the boiler cupboard. Um, and I'm gonna take you into bedroom two, which measures um, 11, eight by 10, two, but it's a good size double bedroom. You've got access out to the garden and courtyard area here as well. You have one of the radiators. But as you can see, really, really nice size double bedroom, plenty of room. Really very, very individual property. So I'm going to take you through to the master bedroom now and the bathroom, which are real huge features of this particular property. Not only the size, but also the bespoke nature, especially of the bathroom. But you'll also get a better depth of feel of how big this apartment is by the fact I'm going to come back. You've got more storage here. And a large sort of cloaks cupboard here as well. So unusually, you know, there is no lack of storage here at this particular property. So I'm going to take you into the master bedroom. Obviously, all the doors are stripped as well. This is 16 4 by 14 1. And it's a beautiful size. Obviously, you've got plenty of room in here. You can see the little outside private courtyard area that comes with the property there, but we will go out there in just a moment. But lots of sort of room for storage. I mean, that whole wall there is, div div you know, is devoted to wardrobes. So there's plenty of room there. So I'm going to take you into the bathroom. Now this is quite unique because it's completely done out of micro cement. It's probably got one of the biggest baths you are ever going to um, see. Um, the actual total size room of this is seven eight by seven six for the bathroom, but the bath is, you know, probably at least seven feet wide. Uh, sorry, seven feet long. Um, and it's now been sort of fully tiled and nice little built in pad to rest here. You have the sort of the stink that's been obviously individually sourced. The actual shower is actually being um, created um, by um, Rag and Bone Man from the television um, out of a sort of a, a girder. Um, so, and again, individually sourced, it's quite unique. And there's sort of the micro cement built in shelves. And then the toilet area just round here. All closed coupled and built in. So it really is something a little bit different um, and unique and bespoke. So I said all the strip doors, this is tile floor. So I'm gonna take you outside. artificial lawn down here 
and then there's some steps up to the communal communal gardens and just to give you sort of an idea of the whole size there's two parts of it this is the um, sort of vegetable garden parts of This is the use for all of the flats in the building. We'll get a look at the back here. And then you have the second part of the garden, which has got some sort of orchids, more the entertaining part. But all this is for the use of all the um, flats in the building. And there's a real community here. Very, very friendly people. And um, you get a real sense of, of community and belonging um, together. So that's the um, property. Um, as I said, it's a really, really great location. Really handy for everything. Um, it's very, very bespoke very very unique really just has to be seen to appreciate everything that's uh, here and offered by this particular client um, it is a stunning flat and whatever i say it doesn't actually do it justice so really it would be worth you coming and have a look at the property to get an idea uh, of it it's very well located for both the old town um, the shops in north down road the galleries the station and the seafront they're all very very close by um, an easy walking distance so book your viewing um, we'll be delighted to show you or discuss it in further um, contact us on 01843 221133 and we'll be delighted to um, make a viewing appointment for you thanks very much for your time today and we look forward to hearing from you thank you bye bye